working together on and off because we've known each other for 13 years. But now, since our schedules permit us to both be off the road right now, this year, 2015, has been like our year to take over the game as like choreographers and consulting producers. and The chemistry was already there, so it was easy to create. For me, I started when I was a kid. I was always that one little kid dancing in the parties. So my mom was like, we need to put her in something. So I've been dancing since I was four. I went to a performing arts school for middle school, went to a regular high school, and I still was in a dance team and like dance studios and competed. And then I got my bachelor's degree in dance. And then it wasn't until I moved here six months, no, three months living here, I got an agent. I, I too grew up being in, in a dance company where I was like dance captain and running rehearsals and choreographing numbers and stuff at the age of 14, but you don't want to, you want to say like, well, I kind of just started, but in hindsight, we've been doing this our whole life and we just haven't realized that what we went through our, through, through our childhood has set us up for what we're doing today. When I want to come up with choreography, I listen to the music, then I freestyle. Then you try to remember what you freestyle. Yeah. And then you start owning it. Sometimes in your dreams, let's say you have a, a gig and they already give you the whole, like, this is what we need to be choreographing. You'll have, like, time in advance. So sometimes it'll be in your dreams. Literally, I have dreams of, like, the whole piece choreographed. And I wake up, like, what did I just do? Yeah, but yeah. it definitely starts with the music inspiring an emotion from your body and your body starting to move in a certain type of way. The 360 view, the greenery, the air, the freshness, the openness of like, we're so people dancing so tight that it was like we forget yeah. to like open our heart chakra and stuff. So like, oh, let's just be free and big and like, you know. Especially the landscape. Yeah. All the open landscape to me helped today for yeah. class to be like, there's space, there's space. Like people think in a dance room, it's always in like in a box. So then when we come in here today, you see movement that's like flowy because we were out in the clouds. So, you know, our movement, our experience yesterday totally like inspired the movement that's yeah. coming out of our body today, mm -hmm. what we're going to teach tonight. Put our hands across. One, two, three, four, eight, 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 eight. I feel like we're lucky because it's two of us. Mm -hmm. And we're also lucky because we kind of... We're not competitive with each other. We kind of have each other's back. So we know when it's time, I know when it's time for me to like, let her take the reins and let me watch so that I can have her back and let her know like what she just did. And she knows vice versa when it's time for her to let me take the reins. So I feel like because it's two of us, that's what makes it so easy because she gets me. I was like, oh, if I don't make it as a dancer, I'd probably teach kids and like mm. help them, inspire them to do something. And then if not, I always think I'm a, a singer because I karaoke. Because mm. I love karaoke. Can we, Maybe in a past can life. Can we give him a note? <laughs> <laughs> Never heard that one. I was like, oh, a singer. 